SpaceX Starhopper test aborted because it was engulfed in flames. Another failure. Travelwire News reports SpaceX's first untethered test of its prototype Starhopper vehicle aborted just seconds after ignition. It caught fire from the nose, the cone. After encountering technical difficulties, the launch already had been delayed several times due to adverse weather. The rocket was due to fire its engines just long enough to launch the craft some 65 feet in the air at the company's Boca Chica, Texas testing facility. But after the Raptor engine ignited, it spewed fire skywards from an opening near the top of the rocket. Despite the fiery failure, the rocket appeared to be largely unscathed. Quote, it appears as though we have had an abort on today's test. As you can see here, the vehicle did not lift off today. And quote, SpaceX engineer Kate Tice said during a live stream of the test flight. Quote, as I mentioned before, this is a development program. Today was a test flight designed to test the boundaries of the vehicle. End quote. The company completed two tethered hops in April 2019, but Wednesday's trial was the first untethered attempt with the Raptor engine firing at 80% capacity. The Starhopper is a prototype of the company's Starship rocket, on which CEO Elon Musk is pinning his hopes for bringing humans to Mars using at least 35 combined Raptor rockets. SpaceX may attempt another hop on Thursday, but the company has yet to officially confirm this. A successful static fire test on July 16 showed the impressive but tethered flamethrower in action. If you'd like to join me on my Patreon account, you will hear content not covered by mainstream media. These riveting stories will be based on my research and I will state my opinions and give my personal insight on diverse and controversial subjects and world events, events not covered by mainstream media and not certainly on not supported by YouTube guidelines. So whatever I have on my Patreon, most of those will not be on my YouTube channel. Please consider becoming a member today. More of the, the most significant and important videos will be on my Patreon channel. Your support helps me to continue my research and keeps this YouTube channel alive. And we depend on your support, your generous charity, because we help economically challenged families here in Athens, Greece, in Kapota, and we also help the young generation with university tuition and the community around our church. Thank you.